Hi you guys, welcome back to another busy vlog. Let's get into it. It's Friday, February the 23rd. I was at work and I got invited to go to this whiskey and cigar event. Whiskey tasting and y'all know we going. <laughs> if you don't know, now you know. Y'all I've been trying to do good making sure my cabinets and stuff are closed all while I'm talking to y'all because every video I be like, girl, you be closing those dang gone. Not closets, y'all. Cabinets. Every video. But neither here nor there, y'all. I'm kind of tired, but overwhelmed. But I think I'm not tired. I'm just more overwhelmed. So, with that being said, we're going to go out and drink us some whiskey and smoke us some guys and eat some appetizers and things and relax our spirit because we got a lot of stuff to go on this weekend. And I usually be telling y'all every step before I step, but we're not doing that. So, we're going to go ahead and get our stuff together. We're going to do a get ready with me. Uh, but, of course, um, remember in my last vlog, I'm going to link it below. That oversized blazer I got from Tarjay for $12. We wearing it tonight. <laughs> we wearing it tonight. So, we're going to go ahead and get that outfit together. I'm going to keep my head in a puff. I'm definitely going to hit these edges up. I told y'all, just come on live for the weekend vlog. It's a weekend vlog. Let's get into it. I'm definitely excited about this weekend. I'm still overwhelmed. Yeah. But can we have a heart to heart? And I feel like a lot of people don't talk about it. If they do, I don't follow them. Or I feel like a lot of people downplay it. But y'all, when you are a 9 to 5, you got a business, and you try to do YouTube or other things, it can be a bit overwhelming. Dot in the eyes, cross your T's. And not just saying that it's overwhelming, it's just the fact you've been a human. Like, you really out here trying to make sure you eat right, you drink enough water, you're working out, you're eating your vitamins. That, that alone is a lot. Besides the other things that happen in life, because life be life in. And you know, it's just like today I really was like, you asked for this? So. I have to remind myself when I'm in these moments that it's not going to always, it's not like this every day. It's because like, I had a lot of stuff going on in the last couple of weeks. And so it's not like it's every day. So I was like, take your time, do what you need to do, manage your time, take care of yourself. Oh, yeah, I know I'm supposed to be doing the 75 hard. You know, I'm still training for the 10K. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. But I'm. Um, adjusting my 75 heart I adjusted the last couple well last weekend this week because you know I went out of town for um a family funeral all that stuff like it's like certain things you're gonna try to kill yourself trying to make sure you hit everything and I'm not doing that so since I'm not doing that and I'm gonna make sure I I do my top priority shh, that it now I ain't saying slacking I ain't slacking on the fitness I'm not slacking on how I'm putting, what I'm putting in my mouth, like my food. I'm not doing that. But I may not be working two 45-minute workout. I might do like an hour workout every day instead of an hour and a half. Okay? And y'all know on Sundays, I don't work out. And I switch that. Like, whatever day I need to have like a rest day, I do that. At first, I was just doing Sundays, but now it's whatever day I feel like I need I take it off to get my body, my mind, my spirit, everything just a break. So it is what it is. I'm human. I'm not I'm not out here trying to be perfect, Patty. Okay, I'm not that girl. But what I am trying to do is make sure I manage my time properly. I'm making sure I'm taking care of myself, missing physically. That comes before anything. My relationship with God, making sure my mind is right, all that. Okay? So the fact that I have all this stuff going on is awesome. And this is something that I asked for, but like I said, it's not, it doesn't be this like compact and overwhelming all the time. So I'm going to take it as it is. I'm going to do what I'm supposed to do. Coffee going to be my best friend. <laughs> Coffee going to be my best friend and just do what I'm supposed to do. Okay. That's it. That's all. But I just had to come and talk to y'all about that because I just feel like they don't talk about it that often. They, I, if they do, it's like in spurts, but I'm just like, yo. That's why they be having mental breaks. That's why they be gone for a while. It can get very overwhelming, y'all. I ain't gonna lie to you. But when you try to make something shake, when I tell you the grind got to be grinding, you got to be grinding. 
Like, and I got a business partner. I could only imagine having my own business by myself because we split the responsibilities 50-50. You know what I mean? Whatever our strong suit is, that's what we do. But I could only imagine having my own business and doing all this stuff. Your girl would be crazy. And that's why I understand when a lot of content creators get to that level they start outsourcing things, having an assistant, having, because there's no way you're going to be able to do get somebody to edit your videos. There's no possible way you're going to be able to do all that and still be sane. So I see that. And when and when the flow start flowing, when we get to that level, I'm gonna outsource big time. As long as I can afford it, and it's it looking like it's supposed to look, I ain't gonna be doing all this. No survey bob. But right now, that's not the case. And I am the one. Okay? Let's go ahead. We've been talking this long. We got to get dressed. About a shower. Freshen up. Y'all, this sweater I got from Shein. It's a real cute little sweater, y'all. Um, so let's go ahead and get ourselves together. We got to get our clothes and stuff. So let's get into the outfit. We're wearing an all black bodysuit. Amazon. Link it below. We're going to wear that blazer. We're going to wear some, like, black boots. It's raining right now. It's wet outside. We're going to wear some um, black boots, leather boots, not suede. And we're just going to test it right now with silver. I don't know what person we're going to wear, um, but we're going to do a nice little face beat. We're going to do a red lip because I want a little color since it's, like, black and gray. I'm going to do a red lip tonight. The, the lip is coming back. And I think that's about it. Hair going to be in a puff. I'm definitely going to slit these edges down, baby, to the gods. Um... But let's get into it, y'all. I got to get everything I need. Everything is kind of where it's supposed to be, so I ain't got to do a whole bunch of searching. High and low, if you know, you know. So let's go. All right, y'all, let's show the outfit. We just literally parked. I'm going to put y'all on the ground. Is it raining? Let me hurry up and show y'all the outfit and everything so y'all can get a peep. I'm going to put y'all in the car because we not even, we don't even got time for the rest. Y'all can barely see me. I'm gonna have to put y'all on the ground. Thugging with my rounds. All right, y'all. You guys see it? Okay, kinda, sorta. So this is the blazer. This is the one I got from Target. I told y'all it was $12. Bag is from Amazon. I link it below. This is the jumpsuit. Nice Amazon. Boots, JC Penny. Rings. Real Sterling, um, Target, Watch, Ancline, Amazon, perfume. I'm doing. I'm wearing the. Um, I'm wearing the Muggler. The Muggler. That's about it, y'all. Let's go ahead and get in here. Oh, y'all, it's nice. Y'all can see me this way. I don't know why y'all couldn't see me. Is it better to do now? Oh yeah, this is better. Is it better? Nah, it ain't better. I thought it was gonna get better, y'all. It is. All right, y'all. Let's get in here. We at Stony Point Mall. If you live in the area, you know, you know. We're gonna be at Griffith's Cigar Lounge. So, let's go. Oh my life. Y'all, I so love this, this little small mini tripod situation. But yeah, thugging with my rounds. I've noticed y'all when I wear my dark glasses, it makes my screen super dark. I have to take my dark glasses off, frames off, in order to um, make sure it doesn't get dark. I don't know why, but because I was noticing it a lot. But y'all yeah, made it on time. Honey, this young lady just got in the car with a little simmer little rumper. Maybe she about to freeze it though. Cause it's already 40 something degrees and it's cold and it's nippy. Oh y'all gotta cross the street. Let's go. Anybody who got eyes can see she just wanna dance and tea. She just wanna dance and tea. Woo! 
Oh, you know what? All right, I'm gonna speak to that. I'm gonna speak to that. Oh, I'm, 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 no, you take your time. Yeah, but I knew yeah, it knew something yeah, was though. Yeah. I was like, well, well I was, and it's okay. So, <laughs> so <laughs> you have a pecking order, okay? And then once you, if you don't satisfy the pecking order, you start to look at who, who, who most recently has supported what. Okay. And from there, I always try to give away one on my page to right. somebody. Right. So, you know, as people was like, oh, I can't come, I can't come, it's like I start to pull from the Got you. The problem is this, if, if somebody see it and I got 150 people who know me, right. all of them like, yo, yo, Back. yeah. So they coming. So I have to, I have to control them. What's going on? What's happening? What brings me joy? Uh, you've been on my page, you've seen where we did the igloo, did the go-go thing, we did the paint. Um, tonight we're going to do a whiskey uh, tasting while we smoke a cigar. I want to uh, thank uh, JR, RJ, uh, and Griffin Cigar for hosting us tonight. So we want to show them a shout them out. I did ask that uh, if you come that you purchase a cigar or put ten dollars in the till because we want to support uh, the business. Also, when we are done. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yes. Yeah. That's a crowd favorite. <laughs> yeah. Right. They add heat to it to stop that process. Uh, they can be regular heat or they can use heat. I do not have a heat of Scotch. Uh, this is an Irish whiskey, the one that we're going to chase next uh, instead of the Scotch. Now, the last one is an American single. We will get to that. I didn't want to bring the Scotch uh, tonight, so we're going to do Irish whiskey and then we're going to do an American single malt. All right? Somebody ever go for me. I'm scared.
Y'all know I said I was starving, but I got everything I need to get done, clean up as much as I I could. Um, when you throw an event, just make sure you talk to people about cleanliness. Everybody cleanliness is not the same. Just be mindful of that. And also make sure you put in your contract. With that being said, everything I'm supposed to do is set up. I right, order my food, y'all, so when I get it, we're going to eat together, Okay. And that's about it. I think I done it already. I just haven't lit the candles or anything because it doesn't start to 6.30. So I'll probably light the candles probably at 6 o'clock. Um, and then, yeah. That'll be about it. But everything set up. I haven't took the fruit and stuff out yet either because, first of all, it needs to be covered. So I'm going to keep it in the containers. Until the event is about to, like, I'm going to say 30 minutes before the event. We're going to do that. And then, that's about it. Everything else is done. I'm so glad if I didn't tell y'all I bought the blindfolds that are individually wrapped. I didn't even know they was individually wrapped. When I seen it, I said, there, the God was on my side. And we got some feathers. We got fruit. And things. Okay. Y'all, the hell holding up. It's definitely drizzling, raining. It's all cool. So I'm in here just jamming to music. I went across the hall to just speak to um, it's just two black guys. They own a candle business. I'm going to put it below the Instagram. We got two events coming up with them in the summer. Like I told y'all, we have a business meet with them on Thursday about that. And then, that's about it. I think that's about it. So I just spoke to them, just speak because they had like a people doing candles. And then I making sure the music wasn't too loud on my side because I was jamming in here. And that was about it. You know, just being respectful, saying your haze, you know. When you're in the business, when you own a business, it doesn't matter if you're doing that. Just be kind. Be open to possibilities. That's all I'm going to say on that one. Because you never know. You never know when the Lord going to 
put you in the right place at the right time. Talking to the right person. Okay? All right, y'all. Y'all, I'm burping. When I get hungry, 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 it ain't got nothing in my stomach, it's the burp. So I kind of got the lights dimmed down in here. I'm trying to figure out what we're going to put. We have a vendor. She um, sells, you know, a adult pleasant trees and things but i like how this light is in here but the station i put her table is no light so i think we're gonna have to move her we're gonna have to move her because she can have some light you know what i mean that's just but i'm gonna do it once my business partner get here because i'm about to go pick up my food it's gonna be ready at 508 my email's here five o'clock actually 455 driving down the street it's like right around the corner and I'm going to get my food. And we're going to grill. We got some salmon dip and a, and a salad. Salmon dip and a salad. That's what we got. I was going to get some wings. I'm tired of chicken. I wasn't going to get a burger. I didn't want it. So I was like, I do. I really want a seafood. But they fried shrimp ain't like that. So with their dips, they got a lobster and shrimp dip bomb. But the salmon dip is cool. So I got the salmon dip and a salad. So I'm gonna eat on that. I don't think I put what type of dressing I wanted. I'll make sure I get that before I leave. I got a house salad. I think that's what I ordered, y'all. Yeah, because I didn't order the burger. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I wanted something light, but still gonna hold me since we're gonna be in, um, you know, I can't say presenting an event, but we're gonna be hosting an event. So, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm bored. This one talking to y'all. I'm so glad I came early though, y'all, because the stuff I had to do, the stuff I had to do, I wouldn't have had enough time to do what I need to do. So I'm glad I came earlier than normal. I'm glad I came earlier than I normally would. And no, we ain't getting no gas. And um, so I'm able to relax. I feel like sometimes if you try to do event businesses, like events, period, give yourself more than an hour to set up before the time period because you know people show up early so i like to be set up at least 45 minutes sometimes an hour before the event even start because you know it's always somebody gonna come earlier than what you expect so i like to be prepared so i like to be like look can i i need to get this spot earlier because the only thing about that you got to pay for time and then you got to include that in your budget and you got to make sure you're getting your profit you know what i mean the math got a math but yeah oh if you don't know i'm in a black owned dance studio called char nation then put it on the wall right here char nation and like three four events here prior anyway so uh she's definitely good people's definitely helped out helped us out plenty of times um yeah that's about it that's all y'all i'm ready to get my food all right, y'all, let me pull up their Instagram, their business page, and I can tell you exactly what's in this one because I really, I want to give y'all the deets. Curse Bar is black-owned, plant-based. It did get me, uh, it did give me the energy, like mad energy yesterday. I don't know what was going on. Good morning, y'all. I can't be up here long because I told my mama I won't be doing social media today. So let's get into it first and foremost. The event went so well, but we don't have a lot of like yoga and content content because this was a couple's yoga event. So it was getting spicy and we ain't going to put nobody business out there like that. Oh, y'all, I'm, I'm over here. I responded to somebody who responded to something that I posted about the event meeting yesterday. Sorry, y'all. I forgot y'all was on. Let's get to it. Lord, Lord, remember me. All I juice. Okay, I had to find y'all. Go on their website. I thought this is a picture that shows them. Let's see if it shows them what I got. Okay, this one has pineapple, carrot, orange, and apple. Hit. They like ten dollars a piece, but it's worth it. Uh, like I told y'all, I've been trying to. 
supposed to been getting a juicer about two, three years ago. I just haven't, um, to be honest. But I said I'm going to be drinking like two of these a week, possibly three. But see if I can fit it in my budget. Y'all know the prices is pricing out here. But I'm going to also see if your girl can do some content for them for some, some product. Uh, this is definitely really good. Definitely see if they can come to our event. This is tasty. It's real tasty. Y'all see me gawking it? Let's go, because we got to clean this room. 16. Y'all hear that room on TikTok? It's 16 carriages. <laughs> Let me play it for y'all. Let me see if I can find it. Honey, that remix. Who I'm trying to is that a Donnell Jones in the back? I'm trying to figure out the uh re the song. Is that Donnell Jones in the back? I'm gonna have to remember. I think it is. And then missing the whip, but y'all, that Jay got me in a choke hole. She need to go ahead and release it so I can play it all the time. Cause yeah. Do I like the original? Yes. Do I like that better? Yes. Okay. It just get a little soul. You know what I mean? A different vibe. A different scenario. That, you know. Call it a day, y'all. Let me go ahead. I'm about to fill up my water. We got to hydrate. And we got to get this room in water. I'm going to come back to y'all once the room is clean. And we figure out dinner. I do got some chicken teriyaki in there. Some legs. I just got to get some sides to go with it. So I don't know I'm going to eat that later. So I'm not stuck that quite so. But let's go ahead and get this room together. 16 carriages running away. Hi, y'all. I know y'all haven't seen me since Saturday. But it is now Tuesday and we're going to work out today. This is going to be me closing out the vlog. We're going to do pulse class today. and I'm going to show y'all what we got going on. So these are the TRX. We use these for working out. We got this, we got the treadmills, we got the dumbbells, we also got these, I don't know what they call, and they should end up bringing in the bikes. So, I don't know what Don got in store for us today, but today is pause class, so what we do, we usually have certain set of times in each section. So usually like in this section with this bench, with the benches, we'll have like dumbbells, we do different um, workouts, and she would give us a list like upper body and lower body. Also, when we row, we also got workouts in between our rowing. And sometimes we want a treadmill, we do workouts in between our sets. Like, it'd be like, um, jog a quarter of a mile, then we have a couple of workouts to do, get back on the treadmill, stuff like that. So, I thought something was on my arm. So, that's the workout sample, kind of, sort of. So, I'm going to show y'all little tidbits. And this is me closing out the vlog because I told myself I'm going to learn how to close out these vlogs. But y'all, Sunday, I rested, and I cleaned my room, like I said. Oh, no, I saw y'all Sunday. I can't remember, y'all. And then yesterday, Monday, I did not go to the gym, y'all. I was extremely exhausted. So I just went home, ate dinner, showered, and laid in bed watching TV, and I went to sleep by 9 o'clock. It got me some rest. And now today's Tuesday, so it's time to get back on this bandwagon, the gym. And then tomorrow, I'll be running for my 10K practice. But I did not go to the gym yesterday. It wasn't a... Never miss a Monday. I miss the Monday. You think I care? No. Because I literally had to make sure that my body was A-OK. -okay. I wasn't A-OK. -okay. I was exhausted. Beyond exhaustion. I've been doing so much. Trying to turn a quarter in a, not a dime, a nickel, a penny in the 15 cent. That's what they say. Anyways, trying to get some money by the mall. But now nah, I was really just, I'm just goal oriented. So, but now I have to make sure I don't exhaust myself. Y'all like this shirt? I got it from Tarjay in the clearance section. It's really cute. It was $8. I really like it. So, let's get into it, y'all. I'm going to see y'all in the workout.